There we go. What's up everybody, Eddie Scales back again with another video and today we're fishing the spillway for a snook and I'll show you guys what I'm throwing to catch the snook, what kind of lures I'm using, what kind of bait I'm using. So stay tuned for the video, we'll see you guys shortly. Gotta be careful heading down some of these spillways. It could be kind of dangerous if you're in a row. Not careful, you make the wrong step. All right, so today I'll be throwing a zoom style fluke. Yesterday I had luck on the twitch bait, so today I'm throwing the zoom fluke. And I got a three odd hook, and I got 25 pound fluorocarbon and 20 pound braids. So let's get out there, see what happens, see if we can get on the fish. There we go. See what we got. All right, that didn't take long. We shook the hook out, but that didn't take long. These snook are feeding today. That was literally my first cast, guys. First cast, I'm, I'm reeling it in, and he ate that crazy. Tell me that snook bite is nothing like it. And uh, this one obviously is a little bit short still fun to catch and I'm gonna put it back and we'll keep fishing first cast at the spillway it's a high tide right now and there's plenty of fish jumping so if you ever get a chance to come out and fish the spillway come out and do it I highly recommend it all right buddy there we go there we go let's see what we got And we got another snook. Ooh, look at that, guys. I caught this one right at the bank. And fought kind of hard for such a small snook, but, you know, still fun nonetheless. And uh, just for curiosity, I kind of want to measure it. It's a 19 inch snook right here. And uh, it fit that really nice. We're gonna get it back in the water. We had it out long already. Let's get back out there and keep fishing. All right, guys, so this is all I was using to catch that 19 incher, it was just a three inch paddle tail. And then I got a jig head. This is really light tackle right here. I'm talking about 20 pound fluorocarbon. And I think this is 15 pound braid. And I got a 2500 Shimano Sienna reel. So you don't need much. Obviously, if you want to catch bigger fish, you need a bigger setup, but it was perfect for what we're trying to do. There we go. Boy, come on. All right, guys, this is hook number four, three for today. Hook number four, and he swallowed the whole thing. I'm gonna go ahead and let him go as quick as possible. We He swallowed the whole lure, so it was a little challenge getting him out, but let's go ahead and let him go. And he'll live to fight another day. All right, guys, got this nice juvenile snook. He ate that on the top water. And I'll say he's about, uh, maybe about a little over a foot. And I'm gonna put him back. Sorry about the GoPro cutting out on me, but hey, I mean, it was fun to catch. And we'll send him back down. That's what he ate right there. This is a mirror lure looks kind of like a green back and yeah he bit that right off the top you see i got it tied to a loop knot right there and all i'm throwing right now i'm using uh this is 20 pound braid tied to 25 pound fluorocarbon all right guys so that's all i have for you today 
in order to catch these fish, these snook at the spillways, you never know what they're gonna be eating. So I had luck throwing the paddle tail, the jerk bait, the twitch bait. You gotta throw a little bit of everything out there to catch these fish, see what they're biting on, and dial in on them. Until then, guys, I'll see you in the next video. I'm Eddie Scales, this is Midflow Scales. We'll see you in the next one.